happy Sunday, friends! Today in our Bible story, we were talking about the baptism of Jesus again! We've been talking about it a lot the last couple of months. I bet you guys know a lot about it. Like, do you guys know who baptized Jesus? Do you know? Yes. Who? John. And where was he baptized? In the Jordan River. In the Jordan River, that's right. And what happened after he was baptized? A dove came down from heaven and landed on Jesus' head. That's right. And do you know what the voice said when he was baptized? Mm, I forgot. Yeah, that's okay. It's okay. He's, the voice said, this is my son who I love. But what happened after Jesus was baptized? That's a pretty tricky question. Do you know? Yeah, yeah uh, I heard me. <laughs> she heard me practicing, so she knows. But maybe you guys don't know at home. Jesus was led by the Holy Spirit into the wilderness to be tempted. But what is the wilderness? The wilderness is a place where there's no food, there's no water, there's no people. There's not even roads or towns. It doesn't sound like a very nice place, does it? But Jesus went there so that he could be alone with God. He fasted, which means that he didn't eat any food or drink any water. And he prayed for 40 whole days. He did this because when we draw close to God, we prepare our hearts for the hard things ahead. And that's what Jesus was doing. He was preparing his heart and his mind for the difficult things that lay ahead of him in his ministry. So today is the first Sunday of Lent. Lent is a time when we, like Jesus, are in the wilderness. It's 40 days, not including Sundays, when before Easter, when we go into the wilderness and we fast. Now, we don't usually give up all of our food and water like Jesus did, but sometimes people give up chocolate and candy or movies and TV or other kinds of junk food. This is a time when we get to grow close to God. And in Lent, we follow Jesus' call when Jesus said, whoever wants to follow me must pick up their cross daily and follow me. We want to be followers of Jesus. And so in Lent, we have time to pray and fast and grow closer to God so that we will be ready no matter what happens in our lives. So today, we're going to sing a song asking God for forgiveness for all the bad things that we've done and preparing our hearts for Lent. Oh, merciful God, forgive us, forgive us. Oh, merciful Forgive us, forgive us for all the things we have done and left undone. For all the things we have. Bye friends, see you next week.